Welcome to Ridgeback Wines. My name is Toy Vessels and I've been the winemaker here since 2007. Before that I was viticulturist. We've chosen Cabernet Franc because it absolutely thrives in the Octopole region where the combination of sunlight and beautiful decomposed granite soils just enhance the beautiful characteristics of this very sometimes fickle and uh, wine which could be a little bit lean at times as well. But culturally I think this is the one cultivar that we do the most of the work in the vineyards. We go through it about five times with our team of women, removing firstly the leaves at pea berry stage, later we'll remove points and uh, shoulders, then later the bigger bunches we'll chop in half just to ensure we have no green flavours by the time we get to harvest. At Veraison we would drop uh, the bunches which aren't fully 80% uh, turned to, to black yet. And then finally, as in this year, which was a particularly difficult vintage, we would send another team of women in just to remove the individual little green berries in this beautiful bunch which has turned already. Um, when it gets to, to the cellar, as always, we try sort of minimal intervention. We have great, as you can see, weather here, so, so extract is never a problem. So it is minimal intervention. Uh, the grapes come in in hand lugs. We just uh, destem them onto a sorting table, remove the little green uh, stalks which may have, uh, which may sort of join the, the berries in the tank, which we don't want. And then from there on, it's gentle extraction, straight into French oak barrels after ferment, where they spend 20 months aging beautifully. If I look at uh, at uh, the flavours that we typically get here in the Achterpaal, it would be beautiful hints of mulberry, a little bit of mint and dark plum and also um, a sort of a touch of dried feinbos, which we'll be enjoying now. If ever you're in the Achterpaal, please join us for a great Ridgeback experience where we're catering for young families. We have a beautiful dam with exotic waterfowl and, um, and we aim to do sort of cultivars that sometimes, just as this Cabernet Franc, are a little bit unusual, a little bit risky and uh, it, it always interesting. We have a beautiful four-star guest house a restaurant with a really quaint little menu of platters and I think the whole experience would be rustic just as we are right here.